So, I'm not a huge fan of the double leg style takedown in a street fight. I much prefer to do some kind of standing clinch, get some kind of trip or something like that. But there's a time and a place, but in a street fight, you got to make some considerations. We got punches and stuff, right? I much prefer to try to get into like a standing clinch or some kind of clinch and use uh, trips and sweeps. One, it's because what I'm personally a little bit better at. But two, it's because I think it's a safer bet to try to take someone down with that kind of stuff rather than really committing and sticking my head right in here. But, the beginning is weak. I don't like committing to being this close and changing levels and all that stuff. In a street fight, you just have to make some modifications to the double leg. I'm gonna show you how to. Do a street? Yeah. We gotta put our hoods up. Yeah, like this. It's because we're doing street shit. You want me to take you down on this? Oh. What if we go slow? I don't want to shove my face right in the middle because, like, the hands are coming, right? Wrestling match, it's okay. He's not going to punch me, all right? Boom. I, I know I can stick my face. I can I give him a little rap. Give him a little raspberry. But uh, if you, this guy doesn't wrestle and doesn't train, when I shoot in, do you know what he's going to do? Like, shoot in, like, for uh, like a straight, like, they're going to go like this. Their hands are going to come to the middle. Their knee will come up. And, yeah, you'll probably get the takedown, but, like, some shit can go sideways. So we don't want to do none of that. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go slightly off to the side and they'll probably try to reach for like a guillotine, right? So he reaches for this guillotine. Now if I just let him push my head over and keep it like this, uh, I'm in trouble, right? So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna offer it to him, right? Boom, boom. I'm almost gonna, when we clinch up, I'm gonna offer him this. He's gonna take the bait every time and I'm gonna pick my head up right away. He doesn't have me, I have him. I get my hips in just like that clinch video, right? And now I can use this as leverage, right? As I, I just do a little bit, this is like a rack pull. This ain't even a deadlift. You gotta have a, a normal amount of strength. You don't need excessive strength, but you need a normal adult human amount of strength. And all I gotta do, and it's a street fight, so I can grab his shorts, clothes, whatever. All I gotta do is I just gotta run my feet this way. Down we go. Boom. So now they always hold on to this. They're, they always hold on way after they should. I make sure as soon as we land, I start clearing my legs. I got to get them up out of the way. I can get this knee back into this hip. Now, here's what's cool is I don't even have to put my knees on the ground. If he's got this arm, I'm in trouble, right? I need to get this arm out and either get it under him. If I get it under him, I can start administering that shoulder of justice. Give him some justice that way. Now, street fight, self-defense. I don't want to hang out here forever. This sucks. So another option, start getting this knee in the belly or and or this hand up here. I grab here or grab whatever and I start creating leverage like this. He'll want to let go. When I make, when I break his hands apart, then I'll reach back and start to secure this. I come up, I'm in this good knee on belly position. Uh, for that so yeah some of you wrestling nah wrestling wrestling nerds might be okay with it you bjj nerds are gonna be like you're giving him the guillotine yes and no i'm offering him the bait right because i'm gonna bait him i'm i'm a baiter i'm a master at it right i'm gonna i'm gonna boom fine as long as i keep my head up and if he's really strong i might have to fight this a little but all this is doing is giving me leverage. And I might just stay here. I might be like, oh, I'm just fine like this, right? And I can like fight like this <laughs> and kill terrorists, right? And kill ninjas and stuff like that. Or I, I might switch back to, you know, some of my tripping tactics. But I can grab a hold of his legs, make sure you clear his legs this way. Boom. 